Thank you so much for that question. Yes, this comes up so often. I recently uh, were talking to a number of parents and just on the opposite end, parents who have grads say, I wish I knew. And one of the big things they wish they knew was how early the process starts and how their child should start looking for an internship as soon as possible. Now, a lot of students will come to me and say, well, I went to the career fair and they only wanna to talk to juniors, so why even bother? You don't only have to rely on that one source to find internships, and it could just be something that builds your skill set. So whether it's working part-time, if he's a communications major, maybe he can freelance and write articles or blog, or he should find what interests him and write some articles and offer to share it with sources that might want to publish it. But the sooner that he can get some real experience, the better it helps him along the way. It also helps them make decisions about what they don't like. And now is a great time to take risks when you're in college because <clears throat> you, you can afford to take some risks. You don't maybe have the same financial obligations that you might have when you, once you graduate, but it's a great way to test out what you want. And employers are looking for it. They're looking for real world experience. There's a quote by NACE, which is the National Association of College and Employers that say that Internships are now being held in just as high regard and are as influential as your GPA and where you went to school. Yeah, I, I would even say it's 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 more. I mean, if I'm looking to hire somebody, I, I mean, I totally buy into that statistic. And, and you're going to get asked, how have you applied what you learned? You're going to get asked. So if you have a great GPA, but you have no applied work experience, you have, you have nothing that you can prove to an employer. But I'm going to ask a question on your behalf, Karen, because I'm, I'm curious, Beth. Um, what if what if her son can't find something in journalism or you know maybe maybe um, yeah like what should he take something else should he should he not do anything which what is your advice great question sometimes everyone feels like it has to be this perfect internship it does not have to be perfect I think you should think about the skills that you're trying to acquire so maybe he's a good writer but maybe he wants experience in social media so he knows how to do digital marketing or maybe he wants to learn more in a different you know film or video anything related to it i think is good it doesn't have to be so only one thing i think be open to different experiences that build the skills that you have so when you come out of school and you're interviewing you can show the different skill sets that you've acquired in different places it doesn't have to be a perfect path from a to b kind of zigzags as sometimes i say or you have to you can do different things that help build your profile.